are we all doing? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to a piece of my world. I made a video over a year ago. It's been like a year and some change and I completely disappeared. And that's because I'm just one of those people that doubt themselves so much. I felt like I was too shy and I'm too this, too that. So I am back and I am ready to get things going. I'm so excited to hopefully build a community full of amazing and supportive people so that we can help one another. And yeah, enough rambling on that. Um, I wanted to do a video on what I eat in a day because I get asked a lot on Instagram mainly, what do I eat? What does a day look like as far as my food intake? How much do I eat? How often do I eat? Um, but keep in mind, this is just a day. This is not something I would eat every single day. So this is just to give you hopefully an idea of what a day looks like. How many times can I say a day? <laughs> but to give you an idea of meals that I would make in a day, okay? <laughs> So let's get to it. Good morning, friends. How are we all doing? I just woke up. Well, it's been like 20 minutes. And I still have my uh, morning voice. I just got ready to go work out. And I just wanted to show you my very fast <laughs> and small uh, morning skincare routine. My skincare routine at night is very extensive. It's like a lot of steps. So in the morning, I don't wash my face because my skin is really dry. So I like to leave that those oils that I kind of collected throughout the night. Um, and then I wash it off later after I work out. But this is all I use. Sunscreen. It's the Aveeno Protect Hydrate SPF 60, which I absolutely adore because it doesn't leave any white casts. Put your SPF on, please. And that's it that's literally all i do in the morning put on sunscreen um i kind of work out outside but not really i created this little garage gym inside my parents house so i'm like you know in and out but regardless always wear your spf um i don't eat breakfast i don't eat anything before i work out because i don't know i just feel i don't know i don't like to i like to eat after the fact i work out so let's boogie I just made it to my parents' house. Um, let me show you my little garage situation that I have here set up. It's nothing fancy, but it definitely does the job. Okay, so I have here my squat rack, my favorite thing in the world. I have some plates, not that many. I need to purchase a few more. Um, I have a little dumbbell rack right here. It goes from five all the way to 30 pounds, which I love. I have a little basket in the back that holds um, like my barbell pad, some ankle um, straps, you know, like little knickknacks. And I have a bench, which is very much needed. And I have a cable machine, which I love so much because there's so much you could do with that. But that's it. That's a little bit of an overview. Very small, nothing crazy, but it gets me going. <laughs> Hey, don't you think I can see that you've been looking at me, that you've been staring at my face? Hey, baby, I don't wanna stay in this club no longer. You can move out of my place. There's no need to be shy, cause you're fun to rock guy. I will take you up by the whole night. Hey, baby, don't be afraid. You just follow my way. Tonight we will fight.
I just finished my leg workout and it was fantastical in the most brutal way. <laughs> Um, as I started to advance in my fitness journey, I realized that I don't need to do eight to 10 different exercises to have an effective workout. Because at the beginning, I would just burn myself out and I would just be tired, but I wasn't really seeing much of progress. So I made it simple. Um, I choose four to five exercises tops and I just go all in on those four to five exercises. But it was a great workout. Um, I'm having right now my little protein shake. It's literally just protein powder and water. I consume it right after my workout. And that's the first thing I put in my stomach for the day. And then later on today, I'll show you as I eat throughout the day. is it. Okay, so I'm starting with um, one of these multigrain slims from Trader Joe's. I like these because they're really thin. I'm just gonna pop it in the toaster. All right, so I have my pieces of bread here toasted. You're gonna see how fast I make this. So I have here some uh, smoked salmon left. This is also from Trader Joe's. It has everything but the bagel seasoning. So I'm gonna put this in the bottom of each one of my slices. Ooh. And then add the other half of the avocado that I used from earlier. So I just cut it into some slices. Mm -hmm. That's really it. So I put a couple slices on one of them, the other on the other one. Steal one from here. And that is literally it. And then I add some everything but the bagel seasoning on top. And that's it. It literally takes me two minutes. Bon appetit. Back again. So, um, Joel and I, Joel is my beautiful, most amazing, beautiful husband in the entire world. Um, we're going on a little bike ride. I'm not that hungry, but I kind of want to eat something light. So, what I'm going to make is just some, like, a parfait. So, just yogurt, some fruit, and some granola, and that's it. Super easy to make. Let me show you. I use the yogurt from Trader Joe's non-fat Greek yogurt, vanilla. Then I add some um, granola. This is vanilla almond flavor, just a little bit. Well, more like a lot. <laughs> and the only fruit that I have at the moment is just grapes. So I'm just gonna throw some grapes in there. And this satisfies my sweet tooth craving so well because if you didn't know i love sugar so there you go and then i sprinkle some honey over it and that is it oh that might have been too much but that's okay mm. look how beautiful this looks mm. 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 two thumbs up Okay, so I have here the ground turkey. It got a little clumpy because I was kind of not paying attention to it. But um, I didn't add anything crazy to it. Just garlic, um, salt, pepper, and oregano, and some little pepper flakes. And now I'm going to add a bunch of different peppers. Let me show you. 
So I chopped up all these um, peppers, green peppers, red peppers, banana peppers, and I'm gonna throw it into the ground turkey. It's gonna be hard to do this with one hand, but you get the point. Let me throw that in there. Ah, I'm making a mess. So here's what it looks like so far. I threw in the peppers, and then now I'm gonna let that cook for a little bit longer. People add different things to their turkey, so don't go up based 100% on what I'm doing, but I just like it to have a bunch of veggies in there so that it's not so bland. So I just chopped up a tomato and threw it in there. Uh, mix it in. I'm also gonna add some tomato paste because I just don't like it to be so dry. And then I'll show you guys when I add that in a little bit. Okay, throwing in some tomato paste just a little bit nothing crazy just so that it's not so dry and that's it i'll let it cook there for a little bit and it's pretty much ready here i have going on some rice uh with quinoa so i did like a little mix of both i didn't show you guys how to do this because there's a million and ten youtube videos on this so yeah Alrighty. up next we have some broccoli Ooh, don't mind the mess over here. Um, I'm just adding a little bit of olive oil. And then I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of garlic powder. A little bit. Add some of these uh, shallots. Mix them all up. And then now I'm just gonna add a little bit of water, not a lot, just a little bit to kind of give it that, you know, and then cover it and just give it a couple minutes. All right, so it's been like two minutes. And look, this is the color that you want. You want like a really bright green and that's it. I'm not cooking it for any longer because broccoli are not meant to be super soft because you're gonna take away all the nutrients, that's it okay but how good does this look so here's the ground turkey the rice and quinoa mix with the broccoli bon appetit so good so that's it thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you got some good ideas on meals to make things you may want to try out and yeah that's pretty much it please leave me suggestions on what you want to see from me leave them in the comments and i'll definitely do those for you thank you so much for watching and you'll definitely see me very soon bye